In the fall of 1994, Francisco Ferreras Rodriguez, nicknamed Pepin, announced at an international press conference in Key Largo his intention to descend to a new world record depth of 416 feet on a single breath of air. Pepin also demonstrated his sled system designed to help him accomplish this feat. The day of the event arrives. We're heading out to Molasses Reef. Our destination is about seven and a half miles seaward of the Molasses Light Tower. We'll be in the Gulf Stream in about 850 feet of water with the huge tankers and cargo ships. When we arrive at the site, the sled with lift bag is carefully lowered into the water. The safety divers enter the water and are marked on the manifest. The safety divers are equally spaced between the surface and 416 foot depths. Now, with the safety divers in place, Pepin enters the water and begins a five minute period of hyperventilation to eliminate excess carbon dioxide from his system. This helps him to deter his natural instinct to breathe. Pepin finally inhales the last huge gulp of air that must keep him alive until he resurfaces. Releasing the heavily weighted sled allows him to rocket downward at the amazing rate of three to four feet per second. Because his ears cannot adjust to the increasing pressure this rapidly, Pepin slows his descent periodically by releasing short bursts of air into his lift bag. One by one, Pepin passes the safety divers and disappears from view. On the surface, the mood is tense. Any number of things could go wrong, resulting in serious injury or death. Suddenly, the inflated lift bag appears from the depths, boiling Pepin to the surface. two minutes and 23 seconds to set a new world record for unlimited free diving. Pepin produces videos that go into far greater detail about the rapidly growing sport of unlimited free diving.